Hello everyone, v 2 32 back again, and it's spring cleaning time, so I've got a ton of decks that I'm trying to part with, I've been trying to part with them for some time now, I try to keep my prices fair and reasonable, uh, I can't do much about shipping costs, prices on my website, uh, when you pay for my website will be in Canadian, so if we figure out prices in US, there'll be a conversion, just for uh, letting you know about that ahead of time. And let's go a quick run through what I have available. I've got tons of stuff available from tons of companies. From Albino Dragon, I've got Name of the Wind, Goonies, Ghostbusters, and Bicycle Steampunk Beginnings. From Bicycle and Club 808, I've got a Bicycle Pluma in Blue, Bicycle Joker, Bicycle Sights of Freaks, Bicycle Rider Back in Black, Bicycle Serpent, uh, Bicycle Escape Map, Bicycle Griffin, World Series of Poker in Red, uh, Tragic Royalty, a uh, Bicycle 2128 Silver and White Back deck. It's not a Rider Back, it's one of those other silver decks. Uh, vintage Design Safety Back in Red. A set of Holiday Backs. One is open and the other one is still sealed, comes in the tin. A Bicycle Large Print uh, Bridge Size Deck in Blue, open. And a couple other open ones, including a rummy one. Big Blind Media, I've got a Carnival Elite and a Discovery deck from Blue Crown. I've got a London 2012 with the gold seal. Ornate White Editions in Scarlet, Emerald, and Sapphire. Unfortunately, don't have the complete set anymore. Uh, I said I kept them together. I've got an Altruism, Brazil 2014. Uh, the Bicycle Lefty deck in blue, which is open, but still basically brand new. I also got the uh, a red version, but it's the older version. It's open as well. And I got the first edition NOC deck complete set, the red, blue, yellow, purple, and green. Of course, all open, but still good. Uh, still good condition. You know, I don't use my cards a whole lot, so they're all good condition for the most part. Um... Collectible playing cards. I got the Bicycle Sistine. That's number 138 out of 1,000. Uh, bicycle Disruption. Bicycle Day of the Dead. Bicycle Thorn. Bicycle Crystallum. Crippy. Limited. Uh, Crippy. What the hell is Crippy? Creepy. Creepy Limited Edition. Number 169. A couple of Physiques and also a Physique Limited Edition. Bicycle Fireworks. Bicycle Pinup. Bicycle Stained Glass. And Bicycle Viola. From Conjuring Arts, I got Allies in black, purple, and blue. A Global Titan in gold. Beast Smith back in blue. Smith back number three in green. And the Zen Pier. I got eight Zen Pier. If you want them, come buy them. Come on down. <laughs> and I got uh, all of these ones, unless I say it's open, they're sealed. I've got from Dan and Dave, the D. Hollingworth complete set. That's the case with the DVDs. And I think there's an informational booklet. And the Emerald deck of cards. I've got a deck starter deck, or one of the versions that does not have the seal on it. Some do and some don't. The Ultimate deck, Ferdman Records, Vintage Plaid in Blue, Atmer Limited Edition in Burgundy, Camp Cards, and also a Fulton's Clip Joint, which is open. From David Blaine, I've got the Black Lions, uh, the black one, the red one, and the blue one, one of each, and a gator back in black. From Elite Playing Cards, I got the Excellence, the Collectors, and the Evolution in blue, all bicycle branded. Uh, from Illusionist, I got Black Artifice. White Rounders, Black Rounders, open, but it's still brand new. Uh, I don't think I touched it a whole lot. I got a couple of brown rounders, a couple of green dealers, not the limited version. I've got six of the king's decks. Again, if you want some, come get some. Uh, two black kings, two inverted kings, a marked 1800s in blue, purple and blue LTD, pressers, executive, bicycle ghost, bicycle saddle masters, uh, two of those apparently, fathom, ignite, infinity, two mini LTD, a complete set of mini artifice decks, which is, they're all open, but they're still new. Uh, it's just that I got a newer version, a second edition, and I decided I don't want the first edition anymore. I also got a Tally Hole Viper fan back, and 
second edition absinthe, however you pronounce that, from the whole, from the prohibition set, of course. And that, that one was open. I used it you know, for a review and still good condition. From Encarded, I got 52 plus Joker 2015, number 204, and the two of the Encarded standard. From Handboards, I got Blades Gold Edition, two of those. I got Blades MMD Edition, and I got a couple open decks, MMD number two, and the Cardmaster is Gilded Edition. Home Run Games, I got triplicates in red and blue, Bicycle 8-bit gold, a mini 8-bit gold, and two mini zombie riders. One of them is open, and one is sealed. Um, <clears throat> from JP Playing Cards, I got the Lux edition in silver and gold. That was the first edition one, the saddle edition. Bunch of miscellaneous Kickstarter stuff. I got hotcakes and red from Usai, Radical 80s. That comes in that cassette tape case. I got a open Jet Setter prototype available. Two of the different decks in green and one in red. Bicycle Quicksilver, which is uh, from Circle City Cards. Uh, two of the Believe decks, which is from, um, I forget the, the Magic Store, System 6. Origins and the Origins Grail, beautiful decks of course. I got the Aquila Standard, Aquila. Borderline, Bicycle Paragon, Bicycle United Carters deck, a Metropole Nux type deck. Three of the Icon decks, one is open but still brand new. A Bicycle number 17, a Moku Hanga. And uh, the, the Bicycle number 17 of course from Stockholm 17. I got an open Vict deck and a bunch of other random open decks and a Gilded Allure deck, Grainback, the CMYK deck, Zombie White and Black, League of Monsters, Plain Arts First Edition, Demon decks, Fine Line, a Plugged Nickel Prototype, a Trickster, a Tlingit Edition deck, a couple of mini decks, The Flowers in the Galaxy, Mythical prototypes and a couple other things. Those are all open. From King's Wild, I've got the Crown display deck and the Continental display deck, sealed brand new. From Mana, I got the Oracle and the Indigo and the Zinfandel. Uh, From Make Playing Cards, I got two each of the MPC Special Edition in red and blue, and I got one each of MPC. Standards in red and blue. A bunch of miscellaneous decks. I got two of the Banshees, uh, plastic throwing cards, one open and one new. Still good, obviously. It's just a plastic card. It wasn't even used. Um, an Ace Authentic purple and blue back uh, set. A Massa, the Amour in red from uh, Coterie 1902. A Fire and Brimstone deck, which I reviewed recently, I believe. I have an Empire Keeper in red. A Manticore deck, uh, the Diamond Finis. And tons of open decks. I've got the Jerry's Nugget reprints in all three colors. Um, Diamond Jim Tyler decks in red and blue. Those are Jamako and they're open. These are all open. Um... 2014 FIFA decks, all three colors. A Magic Circle deck in black. Uh, some other random casino decks. I got a Star Wars Vehicles Villains deck. Um, a couple of, maybe a souvenir deck. Haunted Casino Ghost Cards. A couple of vintage American Airlines decks. And a 601 Eagle, Cardamonde Low Visions, Sahara Casino, etc. etc. I'll post a link to the complete list that I have on United Cards. Fury 11, I got Bicycle Guardians, First Edition, Bicycle Archangels, The Union, Sentinels, Animal Kingdom 2, of the Copper Rarebits, Medallions. Two of the Jack Sellers Blue Edition, that's the newest one. I love me, because I know you love me. 
and a deck one first edition, which is open. I believe it's first edition, maybe it's second edition. I'll have to check. From Robert Tomlinson, now known as Barclay Mountain, I've got Global Unrest, two of the red tuckers and one of the green. I got one of the CSA Civil Unrest, pretty limited because of all the uh, uh, Confederate flag crap that's been happening in the States. Nobody's selling that anymore. But I got one available if you want. And I also had the Bicycle Titanic and the Titanic Deluxe. From the USPC, I got one of the Bicycle Itoya Rider Back decks. I got a uh, Golden Nugget Gambling Hall and Rooming House deck in red. It is open, it does have a cut corner, it was used in a casino, but it's still a cool thing to have. I got one America the Beautiful Moon Sign Midnight Deck or Dark, whatever you prefer to call it, from Enigma LTD. The Sin Lim Wrath Deck, Dance Spirit Crimson Resurrection, Miscellaneous Goods Company in Red and Black, uh, one of each. Bicycle Gold Standard in Blue, that's the Richard Turner Standard Deck. Bicycle Premier Back, that was from way back when B and Poker World did that deck. Texan Deck, which is a USPC deck. Uh, B Miracle in Black and Blue, Aristocrat Banknote in Red. Streamline in blue. I got Aristocrat Stinger from Casinos. I got one in blue that's a non-casino branded, just a Stinger back, Aristocrat style. And another one that's from Quinell Beats. Two of those, one open and one sealed, and one sealed blue one. I got one Skullcore. I got a Real Tree AP. I got a couple of Real Tree AP decks that are open. I got the complete set open in the Fame Mods. I got one that's sealed still. Um, a couple of Tahoe decks in blue. Numbers 1323 and 1331 out of 2,500. And one in red, number 699 out of 2,500. Uh, I got Tally Hole Circle Back in black, Cincinnati version. Uh, sorry, it's the Kentucky version, not the Cincinnati version. A white knuckle deck in blue, Carpathia. Two of the Victoria decks from We Had Crafted. Sinners from uh, Alan Morrison. A run standard edition deck that has a gold box from Murphy's Magic. A mechanic VR2. Uh, floral from Alloys in purple and green. And then I got a bunch of open decks. I got a bunch of Aviator branded decks like the Battle Axe and Planet, Target. Um, I think I got another one on this list somewhere. Those are all basically. Aviator decks with different brandings on them. I got a couple of Hoyle Super Jumbo decks in red and blue. They're like bridge size decks, but Super Jumbo faces. I believe that's what it is. Um, a Jurassic Park deck that's open. These are all open. There's that lefty deck I mentioned, the Real Trees. I got a World Cup USA 94. That's a USPC deck as well, as is the Jurassic Park. Jack Daniels, old number seven, smeared off rocket, old style beer. That's a kind of a vintage beer deck. I do have a Friars Club in orange vintage deck. It is open, has some minor damage on one or two cards, but otherwise it's okay. Stars in motion from the 84 Olympics, an American Airlines deck, make it a Jack cocktail from Jack Daniels, Rich Ferguson icebreaker deck. A Honda Accord deck, for all you Honda fans. Um, one of the Hoyle Slice sets, that one is sealed. Uh, a Best Made Company deck, which is another USB-C deck. I also got a Blue Ribbon Vintage deck, uh, the Filigree back. Open, I think that one has some slight staining. A couple of Tobacco decks, one from Vantage, one from Export A. A Harley Davidson deck made for sale in Canada. And also the Charming Optical Illusion from Charming Toy, which I got way too much money on collectible cards. And a few decks from Vanda, the Mustache, the Polaris and the Lunar, Solar and Eclipse. Eclipse is number 704. And the Vanda and the Crimson and the Golden. Uh, I know this is a really long video. I apologize. Um, but there you go. Kind of a rundown. I want to got tons of stuff 
If you're looking for it, I probably have it. Let me know. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.